Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be testing my track that I made of the Evil 5 race. So this is actually a new race that I made and I'm to be honest, I'm probably not going to change it. But this race can be kind of annoying because if you stay in this water for way too long, you're going to respawn. But that's not the annoying part. The annoying part is the fact that I actually made all of this um, a bit longer than... I wanted it to be. I could have made it even longer though, to be honest. I really could have. But I chose not to. Man, this thing is so fast I can barely keep up with it, man. Anyway, this this race, um this race was designed to be an like an evil race because you have to do all this is actually not a circuit, this is a race. Like a like an actual race, not a well circuit, like I just just said um i also want to point out the fact that i just died there so yeah don't go too fast when you're around that corner just, just take your time do it right you know sometimes you might want to take corners a bit differently because you know you might fall off the edge and go into the water i mean it it, it really happened but it could ha it could still happen you know so let's get on with this race so the majority of this is actually not off-road. The majority of this race can be on-road. It's kind of like a pursuit race, to be honest. I'll be honest. It, it kind of resembles a pursuit race more than any other kind of race. Because you have multiple choices on how you can get to the checkpoint if you want to. Because you, you could go different ways if you want to. But you most but the route that I've kind of gone right now in this race is probably the best route. So I'll be really honest, this race did not take me that long to make. Probably because it's not really a stunt race. It's more of a regular kind of race. I just made things a little bit longer. Um, well, maybe not a little bit. That 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 part there, the one part that involves you to go around the water, that takes you actually quite a long time. So let's get on with this. Um, I'm going to just... Turn off the vocals right now and I'll talk to you whenever I actually think of something to say. So I'll be honest with you guys, I think the best thing for you to do with this race is I honestly think you should just do one lap. This this race is quite long and imagine doing this race when you have like 10 laps. 10 laps would probably take you about around an hour to complete this, I'd say. A good hour to complete this race, it would take you an hour if you were to do 10 laps, maybe even longer. Um, but yeah. want to make this race too difficult so yeah the last race the next race is gonna be the hardest race the reason I had to put, put this up here is so I could see where the where I can you get up here, you know? I had to get up here one way or another, and that was the only way I could think of to actually get up there. This race isn't over. We still got a lot more to go.
I just realized that you could just jump down here and get the ship point here. I was trying to throw you guys off and I just realized that you could do it like that. to the docks now I would also say there's one more thing this might help this might not make any difference but make sure you have your traffic on off I would not recommend you to do this with traffic on because this has been getting really annoying to do I'm honestly getting a little bit sick of driving around this town I think you might be able to tell by my driving I'm kind of sick of this race already to be honest I kind of made this race a little bit too long but uh, I'd say this is kind of evil in a different way. You know, like how this race is uh, giving you a headache. You know when you get a headache from doing something for way too long? Yeah, that's what, that's exactly what I'm feeling right now. I got a headache from doing this race for way too long. I'll be honest, guys. At this point, you're heading back to the uh, city, to the uh, start of the track. So you're going back to Polito Bay now. So this race is almost over. Speaking of which, we should probably check how many checkpoints we've done. Let's check that now. We got 32 checkpoints done. We're over halfway. You know, I could have made this race a ton more worse. I could have made you go up hills. I could have made you go down mountains and stuff like that. I could have done everything. But no, this race was already getting way too long as it already was. So I decided to just stop the race at where, where I decided to stop it. So I'm just going to meet you guys at the end of the race. Okay, this race is almost over, or at least the first lap is almost over. I am not doing this again. This race was emotionally draining. I would not recommend anyone do this race unless they really want to drive around Mount, around the entire island and more some. If you don't want to do that, then maybe this race isn't for you. But this is the Evil series, so I think I did a good job with this race. Considering it's not really designed for it to be a stunt race, it's more of a mentally challenging one, you know? Not really designed to, to it's not really designed to challenge you, but it is kind of mentally ch challenging, if that makes sense. But anyway, we just about it made it to the end of this race. If you guys have enjoyed this video, consider leaving a like. Please leave a like. This video took me ages to make. Um, leave a comment down below saying which one's your, your uh, favourite race been so far. And maybe if the Evil Race 6 will come out. Maybe you could tell me if that's your favourite race or your new favourite race or whatnot. See you guys in the next one. Bye!